authority in heaven and on earth has been given to me, said Jesus to his disciples on the last time that they saw him in the flesh. All authority has been given to me. All the agency, all the power to act in heaven and on earth is at my disposal, said Jesus. So I expect they were waiting for some kind of manifesto, some kind of outline of what Jesus was planning to do next. I don't suppose they were actually expecting that he was about to go from their sight forever. But instead of telling them what he was going to do, he skips over that and says, you, as you go, make disciples of all nations. Because one of the things, one of the many things we learn about God redeeming the world through the life, death and resurrection of Jesus is that God does not take responsibility or agency away from human beings. When God wanted to save the world and to make it once more a place of beauty, of grace, of love, he didn't wave a magic wand. He sent his son Jesus to live a human life to be born as one of us, to live as one of us, to die as one of us, to rise again as we are promised to. And then Jesus hands his authority, his agency to those who will carry his life and his message and his work on. And if you've been baptised, if you've been confirmed, that work has been handed on to you through the centuries of transmission through the church, through baptism and through the laying on of hands. So those words of Jesus spoken to his first disciples are still the words he speaks to us. Go, make disciples of all nations. Mm -hmm.